Yo, what's going on guys? It's Sandy, and I got my Xbox One today, and it's pretty exciting for me because I haven't gotten a console on day one ever. Usually when I was a kid, I'd have to wait like two or three years or so. Or like even the Xbox 360, I didn't get it until uh, I think Call of Duty 4 came out. I always waited because usually there's some problems in the beginning, and let's face it, the price is ridiculous on new consoles. So this was a treat. I got it day one. And the first thing I did was fire up COD Ghosts on it because I was wondering myself, as well as quite a few people that were tweeting me asking, you know, does it look better? And as you can see by this footage, it does look better. But don't be fooled by the, the contrast and stuff. You'll see overall that the colors come out way better than they did on the 360. But keep in mind this is still not a next gen game this was a game made for the current gen just scaled up and that's what it looks like you know higher resolution textures colors a bit more vibrant and for me I enabled the setting um, in the later on in the video you'll see it pop up it's called full RGB mode I don't know uh, how it will look on other people's monitors or TVs but for my monitor it did help the colors quite a bit so it's uh, it could be hit or miss, I guess. You'll see later on, and you could determine if you would use it on your Xbox or not. It's somewhere in the settings, the display settings on the Xbox uh, home screen. But at around 2 minutes and 30 seconds, I switched to like a side-by-side -side comparison so you could see in the same situations the differences and all that. Because right now I'm just giving a feel, like 20 second long clips of just each one individually so you could see both ways but yeah I'm happy about the graphics being better I'm not blown away by them by any means of course I I have an awesome computer so graphics aren't a big deal to me but Kagos on 360 it needed help <laughs> those colors were not good but we already know that and as for the Xbox one uh, you know I only got it like two hours ago now so I really can't give any full detail impressions on it or certainly not a review but right off the bat I could tell this thing's awesome it's a lot of fun to use it's uh, very quick in the menus which is great compared to 360 when you press a button you gotta wait like 10 seconds for it <laughs> you know this isn't 2005 anymore the menus are nice and snappy and maybe in a week or so I'll be able to uh, give a more formal review or impressions or whatever you'd like to call it but it's way too soon to do that. So take a look at the video and notice when I switch over to uh, full RGB at the end and see if that's a setting that you would like to use because I found it to help the colors and um, this game needs all the help it can get in that department. <laughs> so enjoy the video guys. I will see ya.
targeting Los Angeles. Locked. Locked. To San Diego. To San Diego. Locked. Locked. Phoenix. Locked. Phoenix. Locked. Targeting, targeting Houston. Houston. Locked. Locked. Targeting, targeting Miami. Miami. Locked. Locked. Wooden targeting, targeting solution, solution to verify. verify. Estimate casualties. Over 27 million. Choice. We're scuttling the station. I'm sorry, Mosley. Targeting on payloads three and four, been aborted. But payload two is still sequencing. Targeting lock. San Francisco, Denver, Kansas City, Chicago, Washington, D.C. Bye. 